Right, well, after yesterday, um, it can't go any worse. Um, I've come up here to speak to Ivan, my mate, um, just asking me if he'll make today's ride better. Um, today I'm going down to a place called Arzac or Alcatraz as Louise has christened it. Um, again, uphill, down dale, I think it's about 400 metres of climbing. Uh, more off track, more off grid stuff, so I'm hoping I get a good ride, I'm hoping my legs work, I'm hoping this lorry that's coming isn't going to drown all this out, and I'm hoping you enjoy it. And there it goes. Um, this guy was killed here in 2017, um, which feels odd, doesn't it really? I don't know. Yeah, it's one to think about. I've taken a couple of pictures of the commemorative sign, so... But the fact that people are being killed fighting bulls right now in 2017 certainly feels odd to me. Anyway, no more talking, time to get on with it. Off we go! Jolly good day today. Right, well... <laughs> this is a baptism of fire. As you can see, it's not the quietest road ever. And uh, one climb out of there uh, for about I don't know, a kilometre and a half, two kilometres. Uh, really nice downhill bit that was steep, and I thought so I didn't film it. And then I got this. Um, this has come up to 12.5% so far. So we're back to the minute stop strategy, which means I'm up my minutes up basically. So here we go. It's more like it. A few k's, it's about 1.5 false flatty stuff, but it's actually really easy, really pleasant. The road's nothing like as busy as yesterday, so I'm feeling a bit better about the world. <laughs> That was a laugh and then you get to pay again but today's ride's pretty good it's not too bad of these tiny little places with massive great churches and they're all actually really pretty I mean I'm not much of a church guy but anyway here we are this is Jean where I'm supposed to text the wife I was just riding in there after I said this is Jean you see this this is like a, a reader of one of the postcards from probably the uh, early 1900s I would guess the, most of the little towns in France had all these done and to be perfectly honest they've blown them up from one railings. I was looking at them beginning to think the place hasn't changed much to be honest. However, to be fair, let's have a look. See? It's not at all bad. Right, well that was pretty good. That's 12, 13 K, maybe a bit more 14. Really nice ride up and down a bit but a laugh um, and my legs worked. I rode most of the hills, Once, one or two stops on the 12.5 percenters but that's perfectly reasonable in my view. So I'm going to have a little drink, a quick vape, just to prove what an athlete I really am. Uh, sort my life out, text the wife to tell her I'm somewhere close, well, halfway more or less. And uh, I'll get going again. Welcome to Joan. Ah, oh, that was Joan and then a climb, a nice descent, but the road surface was super rough. Uh, it's all rutted by tractors, this stuff down here. Uh, this is a place that I've never heard of called Clade. Um, it's a big long climb, a couple of k's in here. Five and a half, six percent. As you can see, hang on. Uh, 
it's time for a minute as they say um, but it's a nice ride I said road surface could be better but you know come on um, it's, I'm enjoying today cool on we go Whew, right, nearly at the top of this place Cled that's in the distance over there I'll be shown so come somewhere I'll just use this as an excuse to stop this is not the worst little country residence you've ever seen is it look at these places man somebody had some money there you go how pretty is that little church I'm getting, I'm getting to be religious I think uh, right well this is the top at Clay. it looks like I've got a descent so I better fasten things up put shades on and things because climbing I just who cares if I fall off I fall off uh, six point odd it says on a little cycle route sign back there so let's go bimbo um, so I'll get there and do something interesting I guess and then I've got to get to Arzak these places down here I can't pronounce them Louise calls it Alcatraz just to make it easy anyway here we go onwards and upwards or downwards in this case yeah you see I mean this is more like it in the middle of nowhere just riding a bike this is what pilgrimage is meant to be not that bloody thing yesterday top of the world Ma yeah still another climb I suspect I'm going to regret this tomorrow again, but um, I'm sort of climbing all these up to four now, five percenters. Um, just gently the same thing, just turn the pedals, don't push. And I'm getting there, but I suspect it'll probably hurt tomorrow. I've just had a quick stop to, uh, to be honest, I'm wearing a new set of cycling unders and I've had to adjust the Netherlands. Um, but they're doing okay, we're 20 odd k's in and it seems okay. Uh, right, on we go. Woohoo! Right, quick hill climb out here. And I've only filming it because I've been dying to say BIMBO! Now normally I'm fonder of a descent than most fellas due to the fact I don't like paddling uphill. But this one, <laughs> where the way is taking me, the road service is rubbish, it's as steep as hell and it's scaring the bejesus out of me. However, it's downhill. Right, this is the first time in my entire life I have ever walked a piece of downhill. I'm hoping I'm not going up there afterwards, man, but um, partly there's these broken metal grates in here, and this one I'm not too bad, but one up the further hill, and you're about one in four here, and I have no confidence. But to be honest, I want to get to the end of this and not kill myself, so just be sensible for once. Hopefully this is the last climb, it's going to be really steep. I think this thing's up 12%, 13%. This guy, the pilgrim in front of me, I have a funny feeling he might beat me up here. Anyway, we will see. Okay, I will freely admit, this one's beaten me. This has been 15% before I fell off the bike nearly. Uh, so this one, I'm joining the pilgrims and I'm bloody walking. Because there's no way I'm going up this minute stops or not. Whew. This is proper... Alps territory. Well I survived the, uh, the happy little march up Dingley Dell. Uh, that's pretty steep, that's proper pilgrim territory that. And I can't afford to go to be honest, I've no actual idea where I am but it's all very pleasant and there's a slight downhill and the sun's shining, the temperature's climbed up to 30. It's the middle of September, there are worse, worse things to be doing than this. And here we are at Arzak after a right sod of a climb in. But uh, all good things come to those who climb, I imagine. Right, let's find a bar and a wife. There's the car. That's a good start. Oh, look, a wife. There's one. Hello. 
my phone so I'm actually going to remember to do an end video today. Um, here we are, Arzak, as you guys are going to use it, I'll put the name in the comments on the YouTube. Um, really pretty little place, you can see. All of these places, they're all old Bastide towns. And to be honest, they're also all at the top of a hill for some reason, defensive I imagine. Um, today's ride, really pleasant ride. Some of the surfaces were country road surfaces. Some of the descents were interesting. The Rome's route was, yeah, that was interesting as well. But I thoroughly enjoyed today's ride and I'm, I'm, I'm of the opinion, uh, one of two things is happening. Either I'm getting better, all the little rest I've had with the customers has made a difference and it's going to hurt tomorrow. But I'm finding the hills easier. I'm less, there's less of the minute stop things. I'm riding five, five, six percent. The ones, two, threes, I'm not even noticing really. I think the trick for me has been not to try and push on them. It's just to turn the pedals, take it very easy, forget how quick you're going and get up the damn things. And it actually works. It's pretty good. So I'm less scared about them. Um, tomorrow we start from here and we're going down to somewhere, Maslak I think we're going, um, from memory. And uh, yeah, it was a really pleasant ride today. Um, you know, after yesterday's ride, which I wasn't a bit like a con lecto condom job, um, I'm really pleased today. Now I'm back on track. Things are going right again. And hopefully the legs will work tomorrow and we'll be fit, healthy, strong, Superman. Or well, maybe not, um, and I'll be whinging again. We shall see.